consistent throughout the week, because I'm not, like, sleeping in on weekends, you know? Nico. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. That's a Durant. Wait, this kind of looks like a series... Uh, if Reggie Alecki wasn't on here, this would look like a, a series... Um... No, I guess, was Zarina in the original base game? I don't think it was. But, like, if you look at the bottom four, that was, like, Series 2. This is a thing you would see in Series 2. It's kind of crazy. I don't know what to do. This is a little, uh, a little wacky. A little wacky. Uh, let's go ahead and lead off Reggie Alecki and Monkey. Reggie and Monkey is usually a very good lead. Um... I think in the back, kind of need Heatran to deal with a couple of things, but it's also a little bit scary to bring Monkey, or to, to bring Heatran. Sorry, I got Monkey on the, I got Monkey Brain right now. Hmm. No, Heatran does do well into a few things. Uh, let's, let's, let's play it a little bit risky. Let's, let's go a little crazy. Let's go a little crazy. Oh, and my face cam is not turned on here. There we go. Also, it's the wrong size, because I got a new face cam. Hold on, I'm fixing it. There we go. Something else seems to be the wrong size. Overlay full screen. Transform. There we go. All right. I got monkey brain. Like, Curious George. Yeah, dude. I'm curious, like George. Alright. Well, this this feels pretty straightforward, to be honest. Um. Yeah. That's what I figured. Might as well go for it, though, since I'm Sash. That's good damage. Dude, I love the fact that this guy just has a choice band built in. Is it still possible to join the tour? No, you had to join before 9. Whenever there's a ladder tour, the only rule is join before it starts. That is the only rule for ladder tours. Alright. They don't have any switch into this, right? They really don't. They really don't. Yep, figured that much. They should be going for like a snipe shot. Let's see if they're Sash. They are, which means I made the right play. go Dermanitan here. He can eat a hit, as long as it's not, like, crit. Icy Wind? Okay. I mean, I still have my Scarf. So, I'm, I'm about the same speed tier, especially since I'm gonna get a Lucky back in. Also, I don't think they have anything faster than base 95 on their team. Unless I'm forgetting. I, I, I guess they do have the Regi Lucky, which could be a little bit annoying, but I still have my Regi Lucky. Let's get him my lucky. <clears throat> There's their Reggie lucky. <clears throat> Excuse me, I just woke up, so I'm a little I'm a little congested. Uh we can do this. I don't want to mess with you anymore. Do I want to do that? Let's let's do something a little a little riskier. I'm willing to do this. I'm willing to do this. If I win the speed title, it'll always be worth it. Okay, cool. That was that was 100% worth it then. Because I'm going to lose my, uh, 
my guy here, but it should be fine as long as I connect on Regieleki. Yep. Let me do a quick... <laughs> Let me do some quick maths. One eighty four. Sorry, I'm doing I'm doing quick maths. Yeah, we're good. Uh, there's no way around this. Um, what's in the back again? Yeah, we can lock this. This will be fine. Kind of wish I was Ice Punch now. It'd be just as safe. There we go. First Armanitan KO of the day. Alright, now Zarina just has to not miss and we got this one in the bag. Alright, Zarina, great. Great job. Oh no, okay. Well, I mean, I don't even know if you live this. Yeah, it's Power Whip. It's kind of hard to, to live that. Why is it better to swap versus U-turn in this situation? For me, it seems like you would need Zarina to be healthy as possible for Gastrodon. Um, so, in many cases, the reason you would swap rather than... Let's helping hand this. This will be really funny. Um, in many cases, the reason you would swap rather than U-turn is basically just a positioning thing. So like, wait, hold on. I'm, try I'm trying to make sure I didn't misread your comment. I'm still learning competitive, so just curious why it was better to swap versus U-turn in this situation. It seems like you would need Zarina to be as healthy as possible. Uh, so the reason you would want to, okay, I I'm trying to remember what it was, I remember. So the reason that I swapped rather than U-turned in that situation was because I had not yet won the Regieleki speed tie. So it was a safety thing. Oh, they disconnected. It was a safety thing. So basically, had my opponents won the speed tie, their Electroweb would have gone first, meaning that my um, my U-turn would have gone second and I would have lost my my Darmanitan, or they could have just Thunderbolted my Darmanitan and it would have gone down, because I don't outspeed without the Electroweb. was something that we used to have, and now it's gone, because it was a beta test for a product I wasn't allowed to disclose. And I'm still not allowed to disclose what the product was, or who it was by. All I can say is it was a it was a beta-tested key light. Uh, this is not the same product, unfortunately, because it has not released yet. Probably, oh my god, dude, this whole team... The bottom four Pokemon, last game the bottom four Pokemon were, um, were reminiscent of Series 2, VGC 2020. This one is just VGC 2017. This is insane. <laughs> Wait, this is really cool. Um, okay. Okay, 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 okay. I have a lot of options if I just lead off this way. E-Tran's, like, super good in this match. Um, and I think I need... I need Tapu Fini rather than Cresselia, if we're being real. All right. Looks like you might be getting a better frame rate. Yes, yes, because this one is not a super cheap one that I got off of Amazon for 30 bucks. Win now, sir, yes, sir. I can't fit the whole thing in my mouth. When you're playing Pokemon, you have to have the commitment that if need be, you might have to eat the opponent's Pokemon to win. You don't believe me? Why do you think Vanillox is in the game? Can you eat something smiling at you? I do all the time. Goldfish crackers. Very easy. I'm an animal. Oh, looks like they just made the wrong choice. I have no idea how much this does, but I'm willing to commit to this bit. I am 100% willing to commit to this bit. <laughs> if I flinch, if I flinch this, this is going to be so huge. We eating Tauros up here? Yeah. Um, 
I am 100% willing to commit to this. Until that goldfish line that was very sus. Okay, let's see if this one shots. It probably doesn't. It's Celesteela. Oh, you silly goose. You silly goose. Darmanitan, if you miss, I'm releasing you. Oh, holy moly. Flinch. Okay, well, we lost, we lost Monkey. Um, guys, uh, I... <laughs> we lost Monkey, and I don't know if I'm going to be okay. Because <laughs> we just lost Monkey. I'm going to keep it real with you. That play was 100% suboptimal. I just really wanted to do it. That's why. Okay, let's do this. Um, I'm like pretty certain they're just going to wide guard on me. So I'm going to single target flamethrower. Nope, they're going to protect. Okay. That's why U-turn here is very, very cool. So they're probably going to trick room, but I'd imagine they don't have earthquake because heavy slam earthquake isn't a good combo. Usually you would just be like, well, not that it's a bad combo, but if you're defense boosting, you're going to run Leech Seed. That's what I mean. Like, they're not running that. Also, revealing Flamethrower here makes them not want a wide guard, so I can actually get away with something a little crazy. Why'd I have to give him the special defense boost? <laughs> I didn't mean to give him the special defense boost. <laughs> I didn't think he'd be Misty Seed. Why are you Misty Seed? Stop it. You need to <laughs> cut it out. Go home. <laughs> How's the new job going? New job's pretty cool. Oh my god, if they're Earthquake, I swear to god. I can live this. Don't get- Oh, Acrobatics? Well, I mean, I totally love that. Silly Goose. Don't- Don't- don't. Okay. Don't. Okay. We're good. We're good. That's all I needed. We're, we're, we're fine. I'm fine. I'm not doing okay. <laughs> yeah. Job's doing pretty good. Um, it's, it's far. I'm, I'm looking to, uh, to move out closer to my job. So it's not, um, so it's not nearly as far because right now I have like a hour, hour and 10 minute commute. And uh, I can cut that down to like 30 minutes if I move closer, so. What is this team? This team is epitome VGC 2017. Okay. So, here's the situation that I'm in. My opponent knows... My, my opponent knows that I'm going to want to protect the Heatran, so I simply won't. And that's that's all I have to say about it. Helping hand. Yep, they're going to be going for this Tapu Fini. I need to KO. Shadowbone. I need this to one-shot. You don't have a good special defense stat. You don't have a good special defense stat. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, but imagine if I protected my Finny that turn. That would have been insane. It just wasn't worth the risk. I had to play it super duper safe. You guys don't understand. It was the super duper safe play. Okay, check this out. This is how I win. This is how I win. I'm going to score a double KO. They're going to Flare Blitz. Okay. All right. All right. That's actually a lot better for me because now this is single target. So it probably definitely KOs. Unless they're Rockhead. No, they're not. Okay. We have a chance to win this. It's going to become a 1v1 as long as I connect this. All right. It comes down to whatever's last. This goth must have no attacks. That's not uncommon. No attack goth is, but... <laughs> Alright, I know what you guys are thinking. There's no way he can win this. And you're right. 
Special defense drop into win. Special defense drop into, into crit next turn. Zero special attack. Adamant Tabu Fini? No? Okay. <laughs> Good game. I just have to call out every single cope I could I could in that situation and hope that one of them was right. Good game. <laughs> Playing as Heatran like it's an Aegis Slash? Yeah, dude. I simply just don't protect. I simply just don't protect. It's it's a very simple strategy. I've lost to that before where people just refuse to protect outright. And I'm just sitting there like, dude, <laughs> dude, you, I know you have protect. I know you have, there's just like a glitch going on. There's something going on with the ladder right now. Cause there's no way, cause last, last game, someone disconnected when it ended. And then this game, someone disconnected when it ended. And there's no correlating factors between the two other than, Hey, we're both on the same ladder tour. So there's they something going anyways. on and I have to recognize that. Oh, this is pretty cool. Uh, kind of hyper offensive, kind of not. Trick Room feels like super duper good here. Actually, Trick Room Heatran just goes insane. Uh, let's go ahead and lead off with. Oh, do I go Monkey? I kind of want to go Monkey. I could do. <sighs> Let me think. All right, I want to find the funniest way to lead off. <laughs> I definitely need Zarina Heatran. You know, let's let's go Zarina Heatran. Why not? Why not? I want to lead off with Monkey in case they decide not to lead off with um, Rillaboom. Because I could just get a free KO. Like, that's an option. Trick Room Metag Metagross doesn't learn Trick Room. Just fought that battle with you. Hey, good game, technically insane. Thanks for hosting this, Moxie. I'll play on cartridge. I'm actually technically not the host. I asked my buddy Brady if he could host it, because I was at work and I keep forgetting to make, uh, to make tours. Even though I, like, intend to make tours every weekend, I keep forgetting to do it. Okay, that's like literally exactly the lead I wanted. Um, yeah, I should always be able to trick room here. Why am I not flare blitz? I forgot. Like, I I, I feel like it's really dumb that I'm not flare blitz. <laughs> it's it's pretty dumb of me not to be flare blitz if we're being real. Um. But I can U-turn on the Spectre here. Even if they protect, it's still fine. Oh, it's Scarf Spectre here. Okay. Um, I'm still going to outspeed and get off my Trick Room. And, like, switch out. I would imagine they don't go for freaking... Uh, what is it called? I, I would imagine they don't go for a ground move into the, uh, into the, uh, the, the, the uh, Darmanitan with a steel move is so much safer. So Heatran should still be a very safe switch here. They may even just try to flinch me on my Cresselia. All right, that's fine. We got off Trick Room. All right. Uh, this should be pretty safe. I'm just going to go ahead and double target. And I'm going for Flamethrower because it's more damage than Heat Wave uh, after spread. Also, if they're running Bulldoze, they have to have some speed investment on this Metagross to outspeed things at minus one. Otherwise, it's just like a bad set. <laughs> Yep, they're going to withdraw. Who's it going to be? Zapdos? Okay. 
Oh, they do have Protect. All right. Still not that bad, really. I still think I do, like, the exact same thing. Kind of wish I was helping hand, to be honest. I do the exact same thing. I really do. I wish... Yeah, I wish I was helping hand. Can't afford to go for Heat Wave in case they just straight up tank it. Can't afford not to double. Because Metagross is, like, super bulky, you know? It's a pretty bulky guy. And even if they decide to switch here, nothing takes the double up. Alright, let's see. Yep, that was fine. Cool. But after op, that'd be really, uh, that'd be really cash money. Nice. Okay, you're in range of, like, heat wave double ups now. T-Bolt, no para, and we'll be fine. Ooh, that was a lot of damage. You life or oh, okay, it was crit. I was like, that's, that's, like, unreasonable damage. <laughs> Doesn't Metagross have clear body? Yeah. So, that's what I mean. Like, so Metagross wants speed, specifically because without speed, it's gonna get like, outsped by other things after the bulldoze. Let's do this. Trick Room's almost over, so that's, like, totally worth it. I'm also not certain if Landorus takes the double up. Landorus protects, that's fine. Honestly, probably better. Alright, don't miss the uh, Zapdos, please. This is good damage. Nice. Alright. Yeah, this should be pretty good. I mean, like, I'm gonna end up winning with, uh, with Monkey in the end. Because we have, what, one or two more turns left to Trick Room. They can't KO my Cresselia, really, and if I slow down either of them, we're just in, like, Rock Slide territory. Also, it's Scarf. Yeah, we have one turn left at Trick Room. This is always the correct play. Heat Wave. I have to connect this Icy Wind. Cool. No way to lose now, really. Nice. Heatran is kind of... It's, it's a really good Pokemon. I think it's a really good Pokemon. That doesn't KO. Alright. We can Psychic now. We can Heat Wave. Nice. Good game. <laughs> 